Channel 3 is your back to school authority and with everything costing you more money nowadays, we are taking a closer look at how to save on that back to school shopping. Channel 3's Caitlin Nucleo has more on how to cut costs on clothing. They grew so quickly from year to year, they did need, like you said, the shoes, the clothes. With two teenagers at home, Catherine Rosania knows that the back to school budget only grows as her kids do. Both of my kids are a year apart, so they, they, we hand me down everything. The National Retail Federation says this year families are expected to spend $874 on back to school and about $253 of that is on clothing. I'm the mom of four. Back to school season has the potential to be very expensive for me. Bethany Hollers is a money saving expert. She says she always starts shopping on a cashback site like Rakuten. Choose the store where you are already going to shop. It redirects you over to the store's website. You complete your purchase like you normally would. But because you started it with the cash back site, in a few days, you're going to get a percentage of that purchase price back into your cash back rewards account. And this money adds up. And she also never forgets a coupon code. Connecticut is also one of 20 states that has a tax-free holiday. So she says stack these savings and buy your clothing August 18th through the 24th or August 10th and 11th in Massachusetts. You're going to be doing this shopping anyway. Why not do it during a weekend where you can save some money by not having to pay tax on the stuff that you're buying? She also checks out secondhand stores and Facebook Marketplace. But her best budgeting tip is thinking and buying ahead because she says the end of season clearance sales will save you the most. So look for the deals once they start slashing those prices on this year's back to school clothing and then just save it for next year. I saved so much money buying at 70 to 90% off last year. That allows me to stretch my budget. This is a way that I can do my back to school shopping for four kids and probably keep my truly my total budget for each child for their clothes, including sneakers and jackets and jeans and shirts um, to 100 to $150 per kid, which especially in the economy with inflation the way it is, is incredible. Caitlin Nuclo, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.